And as stories are told, once upon a time in a land far, far away, a tale of a little girl. A princess indeed who spent years locked in a dungeon trying to be someone else, masked her face, spoke an unknown language, lived in a forest of unfamiliar clothes, that now she spends her adulthood on a quest to find herself. A fairy tale of love she couldn't contain, indulged herself in books and films but her true love wasn't the same, because her happily ever after came with inconsistency, paranoia and pain. Her carriage she couldn't afford, so she slaved her days away. She told herself she was doing this for the king and queen, internally battling between following her parents or her dream. You see, the princess kept giving herself away, piece by piece, that now her kingdom had a fallen queen. Too scared to acknowledge her own insecurities in case anyone deemed her weak. So her castle walls came up and love was exiled out, but thoughts still crept in. Depression and anxiety, her own fairy godmother, to whisper in her ear, help her fall asleep and lock her in. So she spoke to the mirror, mirror on the wall, who told her she wasn't beautiful or the fairest of them all, who told her she was never going to be good enough, never a saviour of a kingdom when she couldn't save herself. She was told her intelligence is validated only by a piece of paper. How she is seen is more important than what she speaks. She must remain silent, be quiet and please. Because women cannot lead kingdoms, women are weak. But little did they know, you see that princess did not live far, far away. She lives here with you and me. She is the Mulan breaking cultural stereotypes, the Rapunzel with desi black hair, the Cinderella in Air Force Ones and the Jasmine who's LGBT, the Pocahontas decolonizing the syllabus, the Belle with a PhD degree, the Merida becoming an athlete and the Ariel who's an activist fighting for the world and sea. You see, she is not only a princess but the villain, the heroine, the Prince Charming herself. She is the light in the dark, the battles and the tragedy. She is the tears, the laughter, the love. She is the fairy tale. She is not only the princess, she is the queen. And she lives within you and me.